Hi everybody, Tom Fiala here, board certified plastic surgeon in Orlando, Florida. Today's reader question is, Dr. Fiala, where should my surgery be performed? Well, by that I think you mean what kind of things should you be looking for when it comes to choosing an operating room. Well, in my own opinion, I think the things you want to look for are that the operating room is certified and accredited by an external inspecting agency. So here in the U.S. there are three big agencies that you may have heard of. Uh, one that's commonly uh, seen in hospitals is, is the Joint Commission, also known as JCO. For outpatient surgery, Quad ASF, or the American Society for the Accreditation of Ambulatory Surgery Facilities, that's quite a mouthful, so we just say Quad ASF, and, and AAAHC are the two common ones. And for all three of these, there are clearly written, defined standards that have to be met, and you have to have an outside inspector come in and carefully scrutinize a facility to make sure that all the uh, required elements are, are indeed present for safety and uh, for sterility and, and staff training and that sort of thing. So no matter whether it's in an office, an outpatient surgery center, or a hospital, make sure that the place is accredited and that is a key safety feature for you. The other thing you want, of course, is uh, in the choice of your anesthesiologist. Either an MD anesthesiologist or a, a qualified uh, CRNA, a uh, nurse anesthetist, can be used safely for uh, outpatient uh, um, plastic surgery anesthesia. Both work well. At our office, I prefer the use of MD anesthesia, but that's just a personal choice. All right, so look for those factors, and that'll go a long way towards in ensuring the safety of your procedure. Thanks.